What is going on guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. On this tutorial, I'm gonna show you exactly how to edit Zoom recordings with Videoproc Vlogger. For the people who don't know what Videoproc Vlogger is, it's basically a software I reviewed a little while ago. You can find the link down in the description if you wanna check out that full walkthrough. But in this video, I'm gonna show you specifically if you have recorded like a Zoom call, for example, a business call, and you want to edit that. I'm gonna show you exactly what you need in order to get started. So if you guys are excited, make sure to subscribe to the channel I would say let's get started of course right after the intro All right, guys, so now that we are in a video proc vlogger, this is basically the first template that you will see. So right here, it says create new project. So right now we can basically choose where do we want to save our location from our project. So right now I'm just gonna keep it on the same folder right now. We have of course our 1920 by 1080 resolution. And if you want to use your different frame rates, if you have recorded, for example, your zoom session in 30 FPS or 60 FPS, I'm going to pick 30 right here, or you can just choose a custom resolution that's totally up to you so right now we're going to click on create project so right here we are in video proc vlogger so right here we have the preview screen in the middle we have our timeline at the very bottom and on the left we have of course the media library the transitions the titles we have the effects etc so right now what we're going to do first of all is we're going to import our zoom session all right guys so right here we have two files which is basically just the video and also the audio is recorded separately so i'm going to just drag that in right here and i'm going to also pair first the audio with the video. All right, guys. So right here, this is basically the Zoom call that I recorded myself. I just started the meeting on my own. Just a real quick to show you how that works. So of course, when the people are talking inside the meeting, profile photo will change. That is very nice. So you don't have to do that in the editing when it comes to like showing who is actually talking. So right now, let's go and play it back and let's see what it sounds like. All right, guys. So as you clearly can hear, this is my recording into Zoom. This is just a meeting that I want to kind of simulate just to show you how to actually record and also edit your videos when it comes to like Zoom meetings, if you want to save them for the future reference, just to show you how to do that in Videoproc Vlogger. All right, guys, that sounds really nice. So I want to mention that this video is actually recorded inside of Zoom. I didn't use like OBS. I just used the built-in record feature from Zoom itself. And I did not use, for example, like any other software to capture my screen. So of course, you want to basically do just a quick audio test when everybody's talking, just to make sure that it actually captures everybody's voice instead of just only yours. Of course, everybody else will be hearable into the timeline, but of course, it was only just me. So how we're going to start off is I would actually just first color grade this clip just a little bit so i'm going to go to the effects tab right here at the very top and then you can choose which kind of filter do you want to apply on it so right here we can also just click on the search button if you want to search a specific effect so let's go and click on contrasty and let's just go ahead and use that on this video so that looks really really nice compared to this one as you can see to make it nice and contrasty just like the title says of this filter and then of course it will be applied to the entire recording so if you want to go and just have it everywhere you do want to stretch this across the entire video so now if you want to start cutting, for example, like right here, let's say that you're waiting for somebody to join, you can just go and just right click on this clip and then it says split. And then you can just drag this, you know, for example, a little bit more to the right, just to trim it, it looks very nice. And then it jumps immediately to the beginning. So then it's gonna start off your meeting right away. That's really, really nice. So when it comes to like Zoom meetings, what you can also do is you can, for example, translate what has been said. But I want to mention that if it's a long Zoom meeting, then of course it can take actually quite a while to go and edit you know this zoom meeting into video pro vlogger because of course a lot of people will be talking and you have to you know like subtitle every single word so of course you can also cut out different sections if you want to which is not let's say relevant to the meeting you can just go and make a split so right here you can just right click and you want to hit split and then you can also create a transition so i'm going to click on here and then we have for example a color distance we have all kinds of transitions that we can use so let's drag it onto our transition all right guys but of course it's not really that visible because it's the same clip what you can do is just go and transition to a different clip when somebody else is talking and that is basically what you can do to edit your videos into video proc vlogger that you recorded with zoom it is really nice you can add in subtitles you can also enhance the audio if you want to so right now we can just click on detach audio at the bottom then we're gonna have our separate audio files which is really really nice and then if we're gonna right click on there you can just apply all our effects such as the audio editor and then we have all kinds of audio waves from our voice and then you can just choose if you want to equalize 
stylize it just a little bit if you want to add in just a little bit more bass, a little bit more sharpness, for example, just really enhance it. But I can imagine that nobody else in the same you know, Zoom meeting would have the exact same microphone, the exact same quality. Let's say somebody joined in from their iPhone. That's how you can optimize their quality as well. You can also have in fade-ins. You can also have like mutes. You can also have certain different effects such as echo. This is how you add in your color grading, how to edit the audio to enhance it. You can also add in text if you want to. Right here we have titles and then we have just the regular text as well if you want to like not like pre-animate it you can just drag that right here into your timeline and then we will have your title here you can even customize it completely where do you want to have it like at the bottom of the screen time it with the actual words by just dragging the length right here so this is basically how to use video prop vlogger to edit your zoom meetings guys if you have any more questions make sure to let us know in the comments down below i'll be happy to answer it this is how to use video prop vlogger for editing zoom meetings all right guys so that's it for this video this is how you edit zoom videos videos or zoom recordings rather with video proc vlogger it is really really simple how to do that if you want to check out the full walkthrough about video proc vlogger itself how to get started because let's say that this is the first video that you come across using video proc vlogger and you're not really sure how to use it make sure to check out the link down below to check that out first and then come back to this video so guys thanks a lot for watching if you find this video helpful make sure to reward it with a like down below thanks a lot and i'll see you guys obviously in the next video